So we're opening up this get ready with me with me showing y'all that I am up way too early on a Sunday. But we are going to church this morning, so it, come do my natural hair with me. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. My name is Miranda. If you are not new, welcome back, babes. Let's get into this hair. So we are dealing with fresh bonnet hair. As you can see, it is so early that I have clearly lost my senses thinking that I can part my hair with my hands. Yeah, as you can see, I'm struggling because I need a comb. And I know this, I, it's too early. Clearly I can't function. So since I got this side, I clearly thought that, ooh, let me try part my hair on the other side. So guess what I did? I tried to part it on the other side. Oh, but it gets better, just wait. Oh, not you hurting yourself, sis. Mm -hmm. I think you better go find that comb. Found it. <laughs> oh, girl, you show out so bad. Okay, y'all, so I'm parting my hair because I'm going to do a half up, half down claw clip. So this is me trying to go ahead and part my hair into the sections that I want to do. Because in order to detangle, we are going to section off my hair just so the detangling process can go a little quicker and also so we can make sure that we evenly distribute all the products that we're using so yes i do like to separate my hair into sections it just makes the process way easier so y'all tell me y'all have low porosity hair without telling me y'all have low porosity hair can we please talk about how that water is just sitting on top of my hair oh uh, it's so annoying and for the girlies that don't know, low porosity hair is basically when your hair follicles are closed shut. So I basically just have to work a little harder to make sure my hair stays moisturized. So I did use the as I am. Oh wow, this video is going way quicker than I'm talking, but I wanted to share with y'all what low porosity was. So anyway, I used the as I am rice water. And now I'm going in with my honey leave in and I will put all my products in the description box. And now I'm just detangling with my detangle brush, of course, working on those ends. And then I will slowly move up to my roots. Although detangling isn't my favorite part, just because it takes so much time, I do love seeing my curls bounce back. Like, they just look so pretty. And that's just with water and leave-in. Like, I'd be so impressed sometimes. So I'm not gonna lie, I do like this process just so I can see my pretty curls flourish. Okay, now going in with the Wash the Light Gel to Foam Styler. And I am just going to be combing this through my curls. Okay, girl. I see you popping. Oh, they're so pretty. So I'm now moving on to the top section of my hair. So I'm just spraying water, making sure I get that nice and saturated. I'm basically completing the same steps as I did with the lower half of my hair, going in with the Honey Collection leave-in condition, detangling, and then I'm also going to add that gel to foam styler just because we wanna have nice curls when we do do the claw clip.
So now I'm going to take my Argan Oil Eco Styling Gel just to slick this pony back and also just gather all the hair that we need to achieve this look. Yep, mm-hmm, see, I almost left her out. Mm-hmm, her too. Just wanna make sure you get all the hair that you want to be in the claw clip. Brush, make sure you're being gentle with your mane. Do not want to lose hair sooner in areas that you don't need to, so please be gentle. And then I am just going to put that in a ponytail. I'm now just going to take that gel to foam styler and I'm just going to make sure I put that all over my pony's heel just to make sure the curls are popping when we do put it in the claw clip. So moving on to when we actually use the claw clip. So I like to flip my pony around like so fluff up the curls to make sure they're nice and curly and then I literally just clip the hair just like that now if you're thinking how I'm thinking oh girl that's kind of small right so like I try to be cute and try to fluff it up try to pick up the hairs around it so it doesn't you know look too noticeable but you know, I look like I'm satisfied, right? So moving on to the edges, I'm using my Eco Styling Gel, just swooping them, trying to think of pretty big C's, making sure I slick my mane. Give me some nice little baby hairs on the side. I love doing my little sideburns. I think this is so cute. Okay, remember when I told y'all I looked like I was satisfied? I'm not. I go back in. <laughs> I try to make the, I don't know, I guess I try to make the ponytail like sit higher so the puff can be bigger and so the curls can look fuller like so. And I don't know about y'all, but to me that looks so much better. It just looks fuller. You can really see the curls. And I think overall it just looks way better. And my hair just looks so shiny and soft. Y'all ready for the reveal? 